So in this demo, I'm on a nice little chair that rotates, pretty low friction. I also have a nice bicycle tire that's got some handles on it. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to have uh, an assistant of mine spin this thing. And as this thing spins, it's going to have some angular momentum. And the question is, if I turn this thing, if it's spinning in one direction, and I flip it to one side, I'm changing the angular momentum. Because of conservation of momentum, I have to compensate for that by adding my angular momentum. I might start spinning to cause myself to maintain this total angular momentum, or conserved angular momentum. So I'm going to lift my feet off the ground, try not spinning. My assistant's going to come and spin this for me. So I have some angular momentum. Now when I rotate it, I start to spin. If I want to stop myself, stop. If I go the other way, I spin back around. 